question 15 0 0.2 mole of uh, SO2 and 0 0.2 mole of oxygen are placed in 1 dm cube of sealed container and the gases are allowed to reach equilibrium so the equation is given SO2 2SO2 plus O2 form 2SO3 at equilibrium there is 0 0.1 mole of SO3 in the container okay so you should uh, construct an ICE table uh, initial change and equilibrium okay so it started with 0 0.2 0 0.2 of the SO2 and O2 the SO3 is 0 because initially it's not yet formed and at equilibrium 0 0.1 mole of the SO3 okay, uh, form means that it's inside the container then from this information you can get the concentration okay, of the SO2 and O2 at equilibrium so we try to solve the change first okay, since um, the mole of the SO3 is 0 0.1 so the change it should be plus 0 0.1 if SO3 plus 0 0.1 then SO2 must minus 0 0.1 because their mole ratio is 2 to 2 then the oxygen must be half of it because it's 1 to 2 ratio Okay, so the SO2 during change is negative or minus 0 0.1 oxygen is minus 0 0.05 so we sum up the initial and change so 0 0.2 okay, plus negative 0 0.1 so you get 0 0.1 for the oxygen so it's negative 2 plus negative 0 0.05 so we get 0 0.15 so now we get the concentration uh, of the reactants and products at equilibrium 0 0.1 mole in 1 dm cube 0 0.15 mole in 1 dm cube 0 0.1 mole in 1 dm cube so we substitute this value into the KC expression so it's the concentration of SO2 squared over concentration of S sorry concentration of SO3 squared over the concentration of SO2 squared okay times the concentration of O2 okay so therefore it will be 0 0.1 squared over 0 0.1 squared times 0 0.1 then 1 5 okay so you get 6.67 uh, if you want to know the unit, okay, so it's possible uh, because it's the here is mole per dm cube bracket square, and here is mole per dm cube bracket cube. So therefore, at the end you get per mole dm cube. Okay, so answer is D. Okay, that's all. Thank you.